Hi, I'm Brittany from St. Albert Dodge, and I'm going to show you the 2019 Grand Caravan Crew Plus. Coming up to the front of the vehicle here, we can see we've got the black and chrome cross grille with the chrome Dodge badging. We've also got your LED daytime running headlights. And now let's take a look under the, under hood. the hood here. We have our 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 VVT engine. And this engine is equipped with 283 horsepower. Coming up on the side of the vehicle here, we do have our 17 inch silver rims. We've also got this vehicle equipped with our blind and cross path detection, which simply means that the small triangle in your side view mirrors will illuminate when someone is in your blind spot, as well as the vehicle will alert you when someone is crossing behind. Coming to the back, we do have our LED tail lights. We've got the Grand Caravan Dodge and Crew badging as well. We've also got side exhaust, and you can see that you do have sensors that run along the back of the vehicle here. And these work together with your backup camera just right there to create your park assist park view camera, which will give you a seamless parking experience. Another feature of this vehicle is the power lift gate. Simply press, slightly pull, and it lifts for you. Taking a look inside, we can see there's plenty of storage space, quite the depth. We've also got this whole back row with the ability to fold down for even more space. And with your power lift gate, you do have a button on the inside that you can simply press and the vehicle will lower its lift gate for you. Now let's take a closer look inside this vehicle. Inside this vehicle, we can see we do have these black leather bucket seats. We've got the fold down armrest as well. And we do have the black interior. Uh, in the middle, we do have our 6.5 touchscreen display. Now you can see this display is compatible with Sirius XM. It's also Bluetooth compatible. You can pair your phone whether to make calls or play music. You've also got a navigation system in the vehicle here. Uh, just below that, you do have all your climate controls. Uh, the seats in the front here are heated as well as the steering wheel, and you do have a button to lock the controls in the back. And you've also got your eco mode, your power button, traction control, and your hazard just below that. Down here, you do have a small area for storage, as well as two in the middle here. These are covered ones, being that they have these uh, little pieces that go over them. In this one, you've got a bit of area for storage, as well as two 12-volt DC inputs. You've got your cup holders in the middle, and in the back, another covered one that you can pull back. And you can see you've got a change holder and a two-tiered storage area. In Looking there. at our leather-wrapped heated steering wheel, we can see on the right-hand side we do have all of our cruise control settings. And on the left-hand side, we've got our uh, voice recognition, phone command, as well as our dash controls. Right now, we can see we've got a digital display here with a digital speedometer. You can also have uh, your fuel economy, what's playing, vehicle speed, trip info, vehicle information, any stored messages, what your units are in, and your overall system setup in this display here. If we take a look just above the rear view mirror, we've also got some buttons up here that control the doors, turn on and off uh, the door switches to open them, as well as a power lift gate. Now let's take a closer look in the back of this vehicle. Another great feature of this vehicle is that it does have the Park View Park Assist system, which utilizes the sensors and the backup camera to create these lines that will let you know how close, how far you are from something, and alert you if you get too close to an object behind you. In the back of this vehicle, you can see we do have the leather perforated seating. I've also got your uh, button on the side there to open the door cup holder and you do have got some handles as well as your window controls I've also got pockets on the back side of passenger and driver seats for any extra storage and on the back side of this seat there is all of your um, TV plugins there is an outlet two of them and two USB plugins you've also got an HDMI and these are all there in place to create your entertainment system with this single DVD back here I've also got storage and your climate controls following along the back of the roof of this vehicle I'm Brittany from St. Albert Dodge if you have any questions or concerns please don't hesitate to contact us down here at St. Albert Dodge thanks so much for watching